The word algebra comes from the Arabic word al-jabra, which means, the reunion of broken parts, from the title of the book, Ilm al-jabra wal by the Persian mathematician and astronomer, al me The word entered the English language during the 15th century, from either Spanish, Italian, or Medieval Latin. It originally referred to the surgical procedure of setting broken or dislocated bones. The mathematical meaning was first recorded in the 16th century. So, hello everyone, today we will talk about the algebra and, al me father of algebra. The Persian mathematician Muhammad ibn Musa, al me wrote the compendious book on calculation by completion and balancing, which established algebra as a mathematical discipline that is independent of geometry and arithmetic. The compendious book on calculation by completion and balancing is an Arabic treatise on mathematics written around 820s, while al Khwarizmi was in the Abbasid capital of Baghdad, translated into Latin by Robert of Chester in 1145. It was used until the 16th century as the principal mathematical textbook of European universities. It also introduced the term algebra to European languages. The compendious book provided an exhaustive account of solving for the positive roots of polynomial equations up to the second degree. J.J. O'Connor and E.F. Robertson wrote in their Mukta History of Mathematics Archive. Perhaps one of the most significant advances made by Arabic mathematics began at this time with the work of al Khwarizmi, namely the beginnings of algebra. It is important to understand just how significant this new idea was. It was a revolutionary move away from the Greek concept of mathematics which was essentially geometry. Algebra was a unifying theory which allowed rational numbers, irrational numbers, geometrical magnitudes, etc., to all be treated as algebraic objects. It gave mathematics a whole new development path so much broader in concept to that which had existed before, and provided a vehicle for future development of the subject. Another important aspect of the introduction of algebraic ideas was that it allowed mathematics to be applied to itself in a way which had not happened before.